Let us now see about the electrical unit Faraday. It has been found experimentally that the quantity of electricity required to liberate 1 gram equivalent of a substance is of 96,495 coulombs. So this quantity of electricity is known as Faraday and it is denoted by a symbol F. It is obvious that the quantity of electricity needed to deposit one mole of the substance is given by the expression quantity of electricity which is equals to N into F where this N indicates the valency of its ion. Thus the quantity of electricity required to discharge for one mole of silver will be 1F and for one mole of copper it will be 2F and for one mole of aluminium it will be 3F. We can represent the reactions of the cathode as for silver Ag plus plus electron gives Ag silver. Similarly for this case it will be Cu2 plus plus 2E gives Cu copper. For aluminium it will be AlC plus plus 3E gives Al aluminium. It is clear that the moles of the electrons require to discharge one mole of ions of Ag plus C2 plus and Al3 plus as 1, 2 and 3 respectively. Therefore, it means that the quantity of electricity in 1 Faraday is 1 mole of electrons. Now, we can say that 1 Faraday is equal to 96,495 coulombs, which is nothing but 1 mole of electrons. Let us now discuss about the importance of the first law of electrolysis. With the help of the first law of electrolysis, we are able to calculate the value of electrochemical equivalents of different substances and also the masses of different substances produced by passing a known quantity of electricity through their solutions. So here we go about the discussion of electronic charge. This 96,495 coulomb of electricity liberates 1 gram equivalent weight of the element. Therefore, 1 coulomb current liberates which can be calculated that is equals to equivalent mass divided by 96,495 multiplied by 10 to the power of minus 3 g coulomb to the power of minus 1. This is in terms of gram. Therefore, the value of z will be that is electrochemical equivalent mass will be equivalent mass divided by this 96495 multiplied by 10 to the power of minus 3 kilogram per coulomb. So, 1 Faraday equal to the quantity of electricity produced by one mole of electrons will be charge of an electron that is equals to 96495 divided by 6.023 into 10 to the power of 23 which is nothing but 1.602 into 10 to the power of minus 19 coulomb. Hope you got an idea. Thank you for watching this from GTEC Techno Solution Private Limited.